and then you you briefly mentioned the ETs. But yeah, for you, do you have a sense of your guides or the beings that are helping you? Do you do you perceive what they appear, what they could appear like if they had any form? Yeah, okay. Um, it's an interesting question because I was I was asking them myself, and they said it's not important. They talk because we like labels. We like have idea how they look like, and for the for our physical eyes, they can. You know, they might be forming as a, a ball of light, but then for us, there was like, they give an idea how they look, but we can attach to that right away. It's this, this being, it's this, this, from this planet, from this, and they don't want me to go there. They, I experienced them on a ship, on a spaceship, but they've never shown me their face. And I'm like, why can't I see? I'm like, it's not important. It's not your focus right now. That is you- fascinating because it- I am the same. Like I, I have... It- it was, I've I've tried so uh, I'll put that in quotes. I've tried so hard to yeah, see yeah. form, and it's like I know you're here. I know that there that there are beings here, and I know there are beings helping me. And I might even feel like vibrations in my body, like physical. I'll feel physical things, um, and I also notice while we've been talking that every once in a while the um, our connection will, one of us will freeze. And it's often when we are talking about, <laughs> like when you were talking about being on the ship, it happened. It happened when you're talking about a, a high frequency being. It just happened uh, as I was talking about it too. So it's kind of like the technology is being affected as well. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. And I exactly know what you're saying. It, because we are humans, we like to have like oh, idea. Oh, they look like this, and it's like oh, I receive those images from this being. Yes. It does not matter. Like why? What you feel here in your heart, you know it's pure, and you know it's something. And I, I experience both. I experience both, so I know exactly how it feels. So they, it's not. They say it's not important, but I have idea my uh, when I my came from, and I have you know connection with Syrian beings with Syrians and angelic beings and Pleiadians and also my Lemurian roots. There's like a lot of Lemurian roots within me, which I makes all sense because they were all connected to nature. They want to kind of, more than Atlanteans, they want to follow the law of nature. So we connect with nature. Uh, the technology was also part of that, but they were not, they were taking that as that additional thing and helpful in some ways, but they want to use organic uh, technology which is, you know, um, whatever the frequencies, energies, they use that uh, vibration. Uh, so I can see that definitely there, uh, huge. Uh, inner Earth, you know, all of this. And I've been connecting to Inner Earth too, uh, energetically. Um, and, they, and I have, you know, visions of beings, but they are not telling me, oh, this is, this is me, this is us, you know, it's just like, I feel, you know, the feeling I have, it's just like, I'm all of this. I'm all part of this and my higher aspects of me. They're not separate from me. And actually, they're learning so much from me. 